Hi everyone, I'm Margarita Muradova, a personal stylist and fashion consultant from Kiev, Ukraine. And today we're going to talk about trends that are absolutely not only dead, but are like buried deep, deep in the ground in 2024. So the first one is definitely cargo pants. I know you've seen it coming. They've been in like literally each and every blogger's publication, each and every media, absolutely everywhere, in mass market, middle market, luxury market, they've been absolutely in your eyes 24 7 for the last one and a half years honestly so i feel like it's totally the time for them to go specifically cargo pants with a lot of added pockets and very oversized cargo pants obviously if this is something that is a part of your essential style do not listen to any margarita out there online telling you to ditch something that's a part of your style but if that's something you've been first of all obviously considering buying don't do it just don't do it just don't do it girl <laughs> this is literally like like the sound from the TikTok. but also just think about the amount of times you will be actually wearing it and as well if this is something that's a genuine continuation of your style or you're considering it because it's been trending for the last one and a half years and honestly it's absolutely that so you will not see it a lot in street style and also like in other brands mass market luxury Zara is gonna stop doing them as well just because the demand is gonna keep going down just because the, the market's been oversaturated with cargo pants so if you want something cargo go for a cargo bag so a bag bag with added pockets it's going to be in style this year still the next trend piece that is absolutely dead even though it was born literally the last couple of months it was born specifically in september 2023 it's moto boots and specifically those mew mew moto boots they were absolutely everywhere first of all and that is the worst sign honestly for something to be like a continuous trend because when it rises so fast it goes down even faster second of all kind of the inability to style them properly without going into the grungy aesthetic but also just because they've been absolutely everywhere they've saturated the market over september october and november everybody wore them everybody bought them they've styled them it's last year even though it was literally in september so they're gonna be going down in trend this year for sure if this is not something that's a part of your essential style just don't look at them for sure the next one is something that I feel like was an essential part of 2022-2023 is thongs on show. So basically you're wearing thongs and then you're putting the sides of thongs up so high that they're on show over your jeans, pants, oversized bottoms, whatever. Need I say more? There's just been so much of this aesthetic. There's been so much of 2000s aesthetic also, and it's actually going down in trend. Finally, people are starting to come back to like to pure 90s, 80s, etc., and 50s as well. And 50s are gonna be major this year. But this kind of 2000s aesthetic, and specifically this like styling trick, is definitely out in 2024. You definitely remember those 60 bright, crazy cool, color combinated prints that were very popular one and a half years ago, specifically in the middle of 2022, specifically spring, summer 2022, and then also partially last summer. But this year, 60s are not very in trend, and specifically 60s bold, vibrant, crazy prints are not very in. We're into something more, either like light, neutral, flowy, florally, blah, 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 just like in the 50s, or something out there like the 80s. So think zebra print, think leopard print, etc. But not this kind of a crazy 60s print for sure. And the last thing we're ditching this year is feathers. Honestly, me personally, I'm so sick and tired of seeing feathers 
everywhere. Feathers were the moment in 2021 and then 2022 because 20s were in and feathers were like an essential part of 20s aesthetic. But they've been in there on the market absolutely everywhere for the last, I'd say, even two and a half and three years. So it's time to ditch them for sure. There's so many styles and textures you can experiment with without going into feathers. And specifically, we're talking feathered dresses and feathered pajamas. Those those two are totally out and also if you're thinking of investing your money into this kind of aesthetic and you're still into it and you don't care if it's not trending etc etc just make sure you pay attention to the quality of feathers that you purchase because there's so many brands that do them well but also there are so many brands especially in the mass market segment unfortunately that do like such sparse thin feathers that look so so bad that they're not absolutely worth investing any of your money in and this is it for today let me know in the comments below which of the trends are something that you feel very sorry for and you feel sorry to let them go and you feel like there's still potential in this trend and if there's something that I've mentioned today that you're very happy that's going away for a long time now and uh, yeah this is it for now and I'll see you in the next one bye <music>